Hey everybody, this is Nelson of Dragon Reptiles. How y'all doing? This is Sage. Mm -hmm. Doing another reaction today because, you know, I went through and I saw this video was uploaded an hour ago. Uh, it says, this is goodbye. And, you know, this is Brian Barczyk, one of my favorite, you know, people to watch in the world. He inspired me on a lot of things I've done. Uh... And like he said uh, through this video, it says, make every day good. Well, well, Brian, if you're seeing this, every day that I watch your videos made mine better. That's a fact. You're a great guy. Let's get into this. Hey, guys. Good morning and welcome to the vlog. It's been over 2,000 times I've said that or something to the similar. And you guys have followed along and I appreciate you guys so much. It's been an amazing journey and one that do you know there's people that have actually sent comments saying this man was faking it like brown barczyk has to fake it are you kidding me this man doesn't need views or anything like that he does this for the people not himself or anyway has changed my life each one of you have changed my life like you can't believe. Energetic Brian. <laughs> Do y'all have uh, anybody, leave in the comments, do y'all have anybody in your family like Brian? You know, that, that energy always lighting up a room and, you know, got a project, finishes it. He, he's amazing. He is. That was awesome, you know. And of course, the video's not over, but I tell you, I haven't seen this yet because, you know, I wanted to watch it with everyone, but boy, he's got me so far. This is, this is tough. This is, uh, this is a tough one because this is for the vlog. If for some reason um, things don't go well, I think I want you to, to, to uh, I know you'll do an amazing tribute vlog for me. Hey guys, how are you? Uh, I love you guys so much. You better believe it. If something happens to this man, I will do a video. I will go and look at all the past histories and everything. I will do a huge video about Brian. I will make sure of it. You better believe it. So much the reptile army has been so amazing to me. Of course, it's April twenty second, two thousand twenty three. About three months after my diagnosis, I'm a few weeks into chemotherapy now. Um, you know, it's it's been a rough ride. I don't know. Uh, what the future is going to hold, but if for some reason you guys are watching this, uh, that means that things didn't turn out very well for me, and and uh, I apologize. I fought as hard as I could. I wanted to inspire, and I still want to inspire people, and I pray that by now, uh, I hope the aquarium is open. Uh, you know, I don't know what's going to happen if, if, if you're watching this, but I hope the aquarium is open, and I hope that we're inspiring hundreds and Are any of y'all on the edge of your seats here? I'm, I'm, wow, okay. Um. Hundreds of thousands and millions of people to love animals and to, to uh, uh, continue to fall in love with the things that I love. And the thing is, is that, you know, there's a saying that says, you know, you never die until the last person speaks your name, right? So my hope is at the Legacy Aquarium, my legacy throughout everything is, uh, 
is is going to last a long time you know i've lived my life i've made plenty of mistakes you guys know you've seen me grow as a person you've seen me grow as an animal keeper you've seen me grow as my love for education blossom with the reptarium and, and now the aquarium hopefully that's open by the time you guys watch this and hopefully you aren't going to ever have to watch this because if you're watching this this is my goodbye to you and and that's uh oh man I'm sorry, I, I just, you know, Brian Fuel, he's a big inspiration for me. I know it seems a little weird. All right, sorry, guys. That's sad, you know. Um, obviously, I I want to live so bad, you know. I, I, I have so much to live for, and I love life. And this is a difficult journey. It's not easy. It really isn't. And I'm in the very beginning. I'm sure it's going to get more difficult as it goes. I wanted to talk to you guys early so that I at least still uh, resembled myself to some extent. I still have hair. I don't know if I'm going to lose my hair yet. I'm getting skinnier, but I'm not a rail yet. And I don't know if that's going to happen or not. I'm working hard on that. But I wanted to address this early so that you guys still remember the old Brian, you know, and the person that has a sparkle in his eye and a smile on his Like we could ever forget you, Brian. Like we could ever forget Brian Bartell. Not going to happen. You're up there in the Steve Irwin, man. We'll never, community will never forget you, bro. Ever. Space and is excited about the future, and I am, you know. So um, I'm just praying that uh, you guys never have to watch this. But if you do, I just want to thank each and every one of you for supporting me and doing the things you've done over the years. You've changed my life, and you changed the trajectory of, of what I was thinking I would ever be able to achieve in life. And the last thing I want to do is just ask you to continue to support this channel. Obviously, there's going to be some transition if I'm not in it, but uh, but with uh, with the crew, you know, Jay uh, behind the camera and. and uh, the mastermind behind things. We're going to keep this channel going, and the channel is going to be here to inspire people to uh, to, to to fight their battles like we fought, you know, together, uh, and and also to follow their dreams, and and then ultimately to love animals and to love wildlife and love life, you know. So uh, please continue to follow. Please continue to support uh, for me. And remember, uh, you know, I'm. I'm I'm not trying to bring a somber mood into uh, the day, but guys, I really thought he was just kidding around, which I, you know, but I know he's he's very ill. We have no idea how sick Brian really is, uh, you know. I mean, nobody's going to show you their personal level like that, but uh, the cancer he has is it's bad. It's really bad. So. Uh, help my legacy last you know it's important to me it really is you know i've said it before you know i've always thought i wanted to be the walt disney of animals because you know walt disney's dream which is the same dream as mine is to create experiences and opportunities for people to love animals he just was trying to do it to entertain people but that's my legacy that's my legacy that i want you know i want people to think like wow he uh, he changed so many people's lives um and brought them to love animals and to stop being afraid of snakes and all check he definitely did that no doubt all the other things that i do so please do me a favor keep that going and don't uh, don't stop speaking my name and keep watching and keep supporting our, our crew here i have no doubt they're going to do amazing things so again i love you guys so much i can't even tell you how much it means and through this battle your guys' support has been more than you could ever imagine on the bad days uh, being able to, to, to hear your comments, your messages, your DMs, your replies, uh, it was amazing. So I love you guys so much. And uh, once again, I just, uh, you know, if you're watching this, it's not good, but I wanted to tell you how much I love you and how much I really do appreciate you. Again, you guys changed my life. Without that, uh, I couldn't have lived the life I lived. And uh, it's been pretty spectacular. Wow, you know, so that's a big one. Uh, I guess we'll watch the rest here and and see how it goes. You know.
All right, guys, I'm uh, now in the beginning of November. Uh, I've been off of a chemo treatment for a couple months now. We're looking for trials, hoping that uh, things go well. Don't know what the future is going to be. If you're watching this, uh, you know, I, I don't think it probably was good. We hit 5 million subs this week, and uh, that was amazing. So thank you. When I started my YouTube journey in 2008, I couldn't have imagined having 100,000 people, let alone 5 million just on the one channel. Yeah, I have like 325. I'm like, oh my God, yeah. <laughs> It's, it's so amazing when you have subscribers and you know that people have a like like you do or they like to watch what you do. It's it's a really great film. Makes you feel validated. And I'm, you know, don't have to explain that towards Brown, of course. So it's been an amazing ride and I love you guys. And I hope that through this journey, the one thing that you guys are taking from it is that to get inspired, you know, I mean, um, you know, it's hard, you know, going through the treatment I went through and then now some of the issues with pain and, and discomfort and stuff like that that comes with what I have. But I wanted to inspire you guys to keep going and I'm hoping by the time you're watching this, the Legacy Aquarium is open or hopefully close to being open. Uh, I hope I'm there to see it open and, and I'm there greeting you guys. Uh, that's the goal, but we're a few months off from that. I, I think I'll be around. To, to see it so I'm excited but I want to ins keep inspiring you guys to follow your dreams you know even in the the face of what someone like me is dealing with you could face your dreams and keep going so uh, I'll, I'll I'll have some more updates uh, as this video goes on but if this if you're watching this video obviously uh, my pain has stopped I know some of your pains probably still there about losing me and uh, just know that uh, It'll be okay. And I just want my family and my crew, and I want you guys to hopefully... Could Wait a minute, he said his pain stopped? Oh, God, what is this? Okay, like I said, guys, I haven't... I haven't... Sorry. ...continue to support the vlog. Jay yeah. Tomsky, my, my best friend and camera guy, he's going to continue on with Mike and all the crew and we're going to tell great stories. We're going to inspire people whether it's me or not. Uh, I hope that you'll continue to watch the vlog. I wish I was going to be there, uh, you know, manning the front of it, but, uh, you know, let's keep getting people to love animals and wildlife and have experiences and dedicate their life to animals. And uh, if that happens, then, uh, then I'm happy. So I'll be okay. So... I'm going to be up with God and in heaven and Zeusy and, and Artie and, and Kramer, my dogs, and all the other animals I love. Me and Steve Irwin will be having a help. You know, if if when Brian's in heaven, I guarantee you, even though even though God made reptiles, Brian could catch him a few things. He probably could. I mean, I've heard this man spit morse for years now, and I mean, he can just... I mean, the most amazing thing, he's like the m and of morphs, you know, you could just, I've never seen it before in my life, so, Brian, you're, you're amazing. All the time, a lot of my friends, my brother that passed away, we'll all be having a great time, and, uh, yeah, so, all right, I'll, I'll, I'm sure I'll have some more updates for you by the end of the video. This last year has been difficult you know, with my cancer and with the ups and downs of treatment and feeling sick. I really truly believe that we could we could beat this. And even in the face of doing all this, I hope I... I'm sorry. I just... I've had people die of cancer. To see what it does to them. I pray for you, Brian. I hate to see this. But I'm doing it out of respect for him. I'm making this video. 
to get a little bit more out there. I inspired you guys that, you know, we built or closely built the Legacy Aquarium. Listen, I wanted to be there and greeting you guys at the open. That's all I dreamt of. But I'm unfortunately gonna tell you that that's not gonna happen. I'm not gonna be there to see the open. I'm not even gonna be there to see the, it done. No, Lori is going to make sure the legacy is done. It's her legacy too. And Steve Bashy, my partner, is going to be there to help see it through. And Jay Tomsky and Jay Tingle and everyone else is going to be here. Unfortunately, you guys aren't going to see me in the future because I go tomorrow, actually. I go into hospice, which means that I don't have long to go after that. But don't worry about me. I've got Jesus in my heart. And when I'm gone, I'm going to spend eternity in heaven I'm going to be able to look down on the legacy and I'm going to be able to look down on my family and everyone who I love I'm the lucky one I always said that when my pain ends a lot of other people's pain begins because they'll start missing me Lori's holding the camera right now and and I worry about her more than anybody because I spent 35 years with Lori and I love her more than I could ever love anybody in the world and she's strong and she's been my rock through all of it she's seen so many ups and downs and she's been so good to me in these end days i know that she's going to make the legacy aquarium so amazing and she's going to be a bigger part of the vlog and so will jay tomsky and jay tingle and mike and connie and jessica you know and i pray that you guys will god this is really hard i have i mean you gotta understand i i Never met Brown face to face. I'm not that big of a YouTuber, but uh, it's not. I mean, if I would have drove up there, I'm sure I could have met no big deal, you know. But uh, I don't know if the rest of you feel this way, but I feel like I know Brown. I feel like I've known him all my life. I do. And when I was down, you know, I've had my times, believe me. I mean, I watch these videos, it's not a joke. I'm not saying it just to say it for him. He always made me, I mean, brought light into my day. All the energy, the positivity, you know, it just, uh, it, it sucks to see it. this man, this strong man, like this. It's just... It just don't make sense, does it? Continue to watch the vlog. Continue to follow along. Because nothing is going to change. Our message is this the same. The only difference is you're not going to see me. Oh, but trust check. me. I'm ready, guys. It was a tough year. It was so painful. Pain was incredible. Sickness was incredible. The treatment was incredible. Everything about it was so bad. And over the last few days, I was in the hospital again. And I knew that this was it. I knew this was my last hospital stay. I had a couple strokes and I lost my vision. I lost my ability to use this hand very well. And my equilibrium is off because of the strokes. And after talking with my doctors, they said there was nothing else they could do for me. And listen, I love life so much. And now I'll be looking down and I can't wait to see how Lori handles things. It gets everything okay. And I appreciate you guys supporting her. I appreciate you supporting the legacy. I appreciate you always having so much love for me. And you know, I knew the only way I was probably going to beat this cancer was this way. <laughs> cancer won't have me anymore. It wasn't because I gave up. I didn't give up. I was just ready. It was such a battle. I don't know how most people, I'm telling you, I'm a tough person. And I don't know how people get through it because it's so hard. But my battle is over. And in the next few days, I'll be free of pain. I'll be free of cancer, and I'll be happy, and I'll be in the most blissful place you can ever imagine, waiting for my loved ones. So don't have to be sorry. You don't have to feel bad. But please do me a favor. Keep watching the vlog. That means a lot to me. The vlog meant it was everything to me, and I Lori will do a great job. 
so are the rest of the crew. So, I just wanted to come to you and say goodbye. Tell me why I loved you guys so much for doing the things you did for me. The legacy queer would never be a reality without you, everyone that pitched in, everyone that helped, everyone that watched, everyone that donated, everyone that did everything. So thank you for that. And I pray that for generations to come, people will be coming in and their kids and their teenagers will love this place. It'll change people's minds about animals and wildlife. And unfortunately, I won't be here to see it personally. But like I said, I'll be in a better spot. I guarantee you that. Do me a favor, comment down below what you think. Comment what you think about me and me being gone. I hope I changed some lives. I hope I inspired people. And I hope we'll continue to inspire people to love life, to go after their dreams. In the end, guys, the only thing that matters is be good to people. You know, your family matters, your friends matter, being a kind person matters, being a good person matters, nothing else matters. So I love you guys, and I'm sorry I won't be here to guide this vlog in the future. I'll miss every one of you guys, I'll miss all those comments every morning, and I'll miss them so much. I'll miss a lot, but again, we beat a lot of odds in our life. This one we didn't beat, so I love you guys. This is goodbye, but please come and see me at the Legacy. My spirit will be there. Love you guys. You guys be good, be good. Inspire people, do good things in life, make a difference. That's my message to you. I love you guys. And I'm sorry I can't say I'll see you in the next one, because I won't, but I'll still be around. I promise you, okay? Be good, I love you. Okay, uh, I didn't expect that. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I just, for real, I saw the brown. I did. I was one of those people that were a big fan of brown. So. Uh, all right, guys. Happy Dragon Reptile. Every time I do a video from this point on, I will hashtag Brian Barchek. I will never forget it, and I'll always put it there. And I hope everybody in this community does the same. All right.